Hello there, grumpy old fart here. Um, I'm doing a movie review of the movie Moving Violations. A really, really funny movie from the 80s. It was it was a hidden gem. Very few people remember this. It came out in 1985. I remember seeing it when I was in the Air Force. Funny, funny movie. There's there's parts of that movie that are just so hilarious. This is just a funny movie all the way around. It doesn't make any dramatic or political statements. It has no underlying or deep messages. It's just pure fun entertainment. It pokes fun at a lot of different people and a lot of different situations. Um, it's got a notable cast. Uh, a goofball assortment. The plot is that a goofball assortment of students of a remedial driver's ed class, uh, they, you know, uh, driving school, moving, you know, a traffic school, find themselves in conflict with their abusive police instructors. Uh, some of these students do not need to be driving at all. They're, oh my God, they just don't need to be driving. They're bad. But, you know, people have to have drive to make a living. Uh, the star, as I recall, is a, a greenhouse. He delivers, you know, he has a business and he has to deliver, he has to make deliveries. And the, 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 the driving class is interfering with that. And there's a, as I recall, there's a, a, uh, an underlying plot about the the judge who sentenced them to traffic school and the cop that's in charge of the, of the class having a secret deal to sell you know to fail everybody and then sell off their cars at auction make some money you know um, the cast here a really great cast John Murray I want to say he's a brother of Bill Murray some kind of relation to Bill Murray um, Jennifer Tilly Ned Eisenberg Wendy Joe Sperber Nedra Voles, James Keach, Brian Backer, Fred Willard, Sally Kellerman. Sally Kellerman plays the judge, by the way. Uh, Nedra Voles, if I remember correctly, she was the lady who played the little old lady uh, the, on the Dukes of Hazard, the mail lady, the post office lady, rode the motorcycle everywhere. And uh, the, the, she was... Uh, Back in the 80s, they did a burger commercial about, you know, you know, all the burgers are all bun and no meat. They pull, pull the big bun off apart, and there's just a little big patty like that big around. And they go, where's the beef? That was, if I remember correctly, that was her. Um, but she's in this movie. And <clears throat> this movie is just hilarious. Everybody in this movie does good. <clears throat> I always try to do at least one standout in these movies, and... For this one, I got to go with Fred Willard. Fred Willard plays Terrence Doc Williams. Uh, he is a mechanic who is mistaken for a doctor. There's a little underlying plot there. Uh, Wendy Jo Sperber's character is a hypochondriac. She's sick all the time, and she thinks when they call him Doc, she thinks he's a real doctor, and she goes to him for advice, and it and it and it, it, it cascades into a, just a funny, funny thing. Um, now, things back then, when, when cascades like that, people think, back then, people were like, well, that can't happen, that's just stupid. But then you look at people these days, and you're, with some of the stupid things people are saying and doing, and you're thinking, oh, no, that could, I can see that happening, you know? But getting back to Fred Willard, he has entertained audiences around the world. Uh, he is just a funny, funny man. He's just hilarious. Some sad news, Fred Willard died this year. Um, rest in peace. He was a funny man. We, everybody who watched him loved him. He entertained audiences around the world. And he was just he was a great, great entertainer. And, you know, prayers for him and his family. But in this, in this particular uh, movie, Fred Willard has got to be the standout because he just, I could, I could see him mentoring the rest of the cast to make them better not in a you need to do it this and you need to do that no but i could see fred willard you know oh you could do it this way or that way or you know i wouldn't i would suggest not doing it that way but maybe do it this way you know that kind of thing because that's the kind of as i understand it that's the kind of guy fred willard was he was a he was a hell of a good man did a lot of charity work and he will be sorely missed because 
we need comedy in this world. Oh my God, we need comedy. And they don't come much better than Fred Willard. So, if you get a chance to see it, check out Moving Violations. It's a funny movie. You, can, I watched it the other day on, uh, let's say the other day, it's been months ago, on uh, uh, on YouTube for free. So, you can, it's around, you can watch it. You folks have a good day. God bless one and all.